Hey guys, it's me, Jacob. He is one of our subscribers. He is riding his horse, Jasper, who he raised from a bull and he has trained him himself at 15 years of age. This is Jasper's fourth ride. Thanks for sharing, Jacob. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. Sam, my eyes look sore. I don't know. I feel like I have like the slightest headache where it makes me feel like I'm tired. But anyways, good morning. Wow, I just said good morning and then complained. Let me start again. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Today is February. The second is Groundhog's Day. We are excited and waiting to see if we're gonna get six more weeks of winter or not. And no. do you guys believe in that? Do you believe in Groundhog's Day? Anyways, I have to tell you another story. It's not winter for six more weeks. No, she didn't see her shadow. She didn't see her shadow? Awesome, yeah, okay. Groundhog. All right, so this is the dilemma. So Sam got this package in the mail. Hey, what is it? And he says, oh, it's your Valentine's present. <laughs> and then. No, oh, I don't know. It could be your Valentine's Day. Yeah, then I said, why did you tell me that? Because now I think I know what my Valentine's Day present is. I like to be surprised. What is your Valentine's Day present? I think it's it, a record player. It's pretty light. I think it's a record player. It is not a record player. It's not. I, I know what it <laughs> is, and it's not a record player. <laughs> but a record player would be this light and shame. All right, so he says I can open it. You can open it now only because you'll see why when you open it. You, I want, you want me to send it back? Stay warm, keep comfort. Oh, it's not a record player. Mom, why did you want a record player? Because uh, Dad was mentioning it the other day, and I do want a record player. Is this actually for me, actually? Yeah. <laughs> is this actually for me, he says? All right, what is I'll it? I'll open it. <gasps> is it a new coat? It's, it's a coat, I think. Wow, I just said I wanted a new yeah, coat the other here, day. I'll and open it for you. All right, open it for me. Let's see what this baby looks like. All right. So, wow, it's like a blanket. So if we pull it out. Thanks for letting me have it early. I'm gonna need it. Ooh, oh, oh, it's a really long coat like you Wow, want. it is so nice. I love it. I wanted a really long coat. Wow. It's, it's down filled. Okay, he has outdone himself. Like, I'm not even joking. This is my dream coat. Holy! Look at it. Look at how long it goes. Can you guys even see? All the way down. And it's so warm. And it zips up so you can sit. I got dog hair on it. Holy. Oh my gosh. I'm obsessed. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I'll be warm for sure. <laughs> hey, guys, see me? <laughs> That's crazy. I I love it. It is perfect. This Wow. Wow. And the pockets? The pockets have a warmer in it. The pockets have a warmer in it. I was just going to say the pockets are so warm. I love it. I love the color. Wow, this turned into a good day. <laughs> You should have waited for Valentine's Day. It's going to be really yeah. cold. It's going to be cold tonight. So Tomorrow is going to be Tomorrow. the coldest day ever. There you go. It's a long coat like you liked. The hood's not completely on your head. Pull it forward more. I can't. So, yeah, wait, I don't know. Pull it forward the hood more is, and show me. But it's kind of weird. Right. I'm not yeah, sure I'll if you can take the hood off. The hood. But I love it. I absolutely love it. The hood is going to drive me crazy. I'll fix it. I'll figure it out. It is perfect. I love it. Thank you so much. It is awesome. I don't want to take it off. I don't want to take it off, but the problem is I don't want it to be stinky, but I want one to wear to lessons. I want like, I love it. I am so appreciative. Thank you. Thank you. Like I, it feels like I'm wearing a blanket down to my ankles. Oh, well, hello dog. <laughs> All right. We're headed down to the barn. I have a fun activity I wanted to do. And it is going to be so cold tonight. It's starting to get windy now. I'm surprised for the horses. 
I have a surprise for the horses. What is it? See. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> it's the icicle. Ruby coming down in the barn too? She's not here. We are not in a snowbank. Don't worry about this. <laughs> I'm not worried. I trust Gabby. Believe it or not, I like trust her ability yeah, to drive. Fix this. All right, you fix this. Dad, it was Dad's fault. He parked way out. So do you guys remember when Gabby first started driving at the I think last spring, just in our driveway? And she drove up to the house in the dark when we were trying. Yeah, to like, like she nice just started driving. not that long ago. She is she like look at how confident she is. She just she knows how to drive. Like Gabby is totally an introvert in every single way imaginable. Molly, get but back here. Molly, get back here. But she Go can drive. She can drive and she can do. I can drive with no hands. Put your hands on there. Only dad does that. Only dad does that. You're not getting stuck. Either. No, we're not getting stuck. Maybe we should put our seatbelts on. No, I'm just kidding. She has it in four wheel drive. Look good. She has it in four wheel drive. <laughs> He's like this. Is, I don't even know what four wheel drive is or where it is or when you use it. Like I don't do. You use it when you get four wheel drive. But here we are. Don't use it when you get safe stuck. and sound at the barn. Last time when I brought Willow and I school, she loved it. So I'm hoping she loves this one. Even though this is only half. I'm not gonna lie. This coat. It's nice and like it feels really good in the top. It's hard to get used to though. It's gonna take some getting used to. Oh. Did you see us coming down? <laughs> Hi, Gracie. She's like, no. Well, hello, Penny Pickle. How are you today? It's cold outside. Yeah. Oh, do you know? Do you know how I can tell Penny loves her ball? <laughs> because when she gets bored, she always goes to it. And when. She tries to eat it. She's like, wait. I'm gonna throw no. it. No! You, if you throw this, you will get me the other half that's stuck to the ground. Okay. So Penny does the balls when she's like, when she's bored, when she's like, she's always relaxed when she pushes her balls. Sorry. I taught her to do that and it's a bad habit because she pushes everything. I know. Did you not bring gloves? Oh. I never bring gloves, but I have a really big sweater so I can just wear it as gloves. And my coat actually has hand warmers inside of it. Um, we're gonna set up something that I want us to do with our ponies this week, and then we'll show you guys. It's gonna, it's starting to get really cold, and we have like, we're gonna feed the horses, and we have to still feed the horses and do chores, <laughs> afternoon chores. So I'm gonna put you guys down, and we're gonna get ready. Also, I always carry horse treats in my pocket. Like, I'm a horse treat person. I don't wanna wreck this coat, but I want, I can feel a difference though. Holy heck, am I ever warm. Um, so I don't know how that's gonna work. I'm gonna have to get like a pouch or something. I know her tail's long. So uh, this is our tea, and this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna, t I'm gonna tell you guys the instructions. Okay, so you can do this with a lead rope on, a halter on, or, not a lead rope. or at liberty. So watch, you're gonna walk your horse down this path to the very end. Take one step outside of the box. Then you're gonna back up Okay, Sophie's gonna demonstrate. I had to actually change batteries. She's not the best at backing up in a straight line yet. But. Yeah, she's not perfect at backing up in a straight line yet, but she's getting there. One step out of it, and you have to stay on the outside of the T the whole time. And then you turn around. Oh, you have to be on the outside of the T the whole time, though. Oh, okay. How are we supposed to do that? Yeah, it's a big T. Okay. It's 
So contestant number one. I haven't even practiced. You don't even need to practice this. Okay, one, no, one step out of the T. Stop. Good girl. Back up. See how she changed sides there? That was so smart. This is the hard part. Oh, she went out. But that's okay, it's still really good. Good girl. Penny's like, all right, I'll just push the ball down it. Is that okay? <laughs> good girl. <laughs> Come on, you're in the middle. <laughs> Penny's like. <laughs> Sophie's choosing to do this at Liberty. Oh, she has to step right out. And you should change sides. I know, there's a pole there. Come on. No. That's, oh. That's the hard part right there. It's because she backed into a pole. Yeah. Here, I have to be on the other She's side. She's like, I don't like this. Let me spin. It's way easier. <laughs>just one step out but really good it's hard isn't it all right so he's trial number two right out you have to step right out You're not supposed to step in there. Whatever. Oh, I can do that. You just jump over. Just step over. Penny's like, I am doing it. <laughs> Imagine I have my turn and Penny's like the queen at it. <laughs> so he said, Imagine you have your turn and then Penny just stands there pushing stuff. Yeah, well, that could happen. Yeah, it's hard. It's definitely hard. Like, I thought it would be so easy. You know, I think Chino might Yeah, we're gonna do Chino too. Uh, All right, can somebody film me? what does Willow want to do? Just <laughs> to run over them? Alright, well I like this activity though. Like I think it's important. I have to go back and read what actually we're supposed to do because it's supposed to be narrow at the top like this. It's supposed to be narrow at the top like that. Um, but I'm finding it hard to get our horses to back up unless we walk back straight like they only go back straight if we walk in front of them if i step to the side at all then they go to the side i think that's probably natural because all of our horses are doing it chino bambino's turn i love him it's all matching i know i was like that with penny too can you turn in here
Like, what the heck? <laughs> He's like prancing. Wow! Chino can do it! He stepped out. He barely stepped out, though. He did so good. See, I feel like it's so different if we take the other horses out. They're out there. They're out there having their lunch. Oh, just barely. You have to save spot, too. Yeah. Good job. Chino definitely wins. You're a winner. The weather is picking it up, picking up. The weather is picking up. I, so we actually, yeah, we actually, we actually thought that Honey was going to get blown away there for a minute. That's how windy it is. It's insane. Oh, we are headed into town to get some groceries and provisions for the next 24 hours. I don't know what's going to happen. We're, but we're in for like a wicked, wicked storm. It's wild, guys. Like, I hate this. I, when you can't see. <laughs> no, this thing I can't see. Oh. Anyway, we're headed into town. Yeah, the weather is changing. <sighs> it's fine. Dad normally does this. Yeah, I know. It's good that he teaches her how to drive in snow. And we're back home. Uh, the weather is getting bad. We won't go out at all tomorrow. It's funny how that happens, though. How like if the weather gets bad and you can't go out, you like go shopping and buy everything you need for a month, even though it's only like a day. So wish us luck for tomorrow and we'll see you then. Don't you know that you're beautiful?